Hello and welcome to another Popper video. Today we're going to be playing Alter Combotron, sometimes known as Tronbo. So the way this works is Ashnod's Alter says sacrifice a creature, add two mana. We over here have Mirror Retriever that costs exactly two mana, and when it dies you can return another artifact card from your graveyard to your hand. So we just sacrifice our Retriever in play, get our Retriever from the graveyard back. That is an infinite loop right here. So, what do we want to do with that? When Golem Foundry is in play, you get infinite Golem Foundry 3-3 uh, three, three generation. It says whenever you cast an artifact spell, you can put a charge counter on Golem Foundry, and then you get infinite 3-3s. Three, threes. Once you have infinite 3-3s, three, threes, you technically have infinite mana, because you can sacrifice the 3-3s three, threes for mana with Ashnaut's Altar. Then you can shoot your opponent with makeshift munitions with the other infinite 3-3s three, threes that you just happen to have in play. <clears throat> This deck has an upgrade here with Energy Refractor that just came out in this new set. So it says 2 mana, add 1 mana of any color. You, you don't have to tap it, which is extremely important. Because you don't have to tap it, we have now an infinite draw your deck combo as well with Blood Fountain. Blood Fountain says pay 3 and a black, sacrifice Blood Fountain, return up to 2 target creature cards from your graveyard to your hand. Also it creates a blood token. So if you have the loop going, but you don't have any card draw, you haven't found your makeshift munitions, you can just Blood Fountain back, you can sacrifice Mirror Retriever, get, get back Blood Fountain, sacrifice your second Mirror Retriever, get back Chromatic Star or whatever, play out the Blood Fountain, sacrifice the Blood Fountain to get back both Mirror Retrievers, and that's going to be actually continuing to draw you cards because you're can tripping with these things plus you also have the uh, blood token to loot with we're going to see if we can implement that in time in uh, the matches today also in today's list i'm going for the four deadly dispute three reckoners bargain i think that playing faithless looting like over here uh just doesn't work as well in this deck because the Alter deck is not playing quite as many one drops. You can see here that this has a ton of one drops, a ton of just like blind card draw. And then in eggs, you end up flooding out a ton. Over here in our Alter list, we're really concentrating on drawing as many cards as fast as possible because we want to draw into our combo immediately. Uh, I found that playing the looting would just slow us down and end up making the deck a little bit worse. I'm taking something that I discussed with Sandpop instead of playing the four bobble and the frantic salvage i'm just playing three bobble and the two blood fountains we can sacrifice our mirror retriever to get back the bobble and then bobble back something that we can't get back with the mirror retriever and then get back the mirror retriever with the blood fountain it's just like this very interesting value play so that allows us to play this blood fountain loop without playing um going too deep and then I'm only playing three Energy Refractors here. I'm also playing one Mystical Teachings. I like having three Weather the Storm effects in the main, but I don't like having three Weather the Storms exactly because I found it's a dead card in non-red matchups. So I'm playing the Teachings here, and I have the Bobble to get back the Weather the Storm so we have more effective copies. And then we'll just try to draw into it with all of our draw effects. Over here the Mana Base, we have our Mine Power Plant Tower combo so that if these three lands are in play we have seven mana and then i used to play two swamps i'm taking a risk here today to play three grottos that's going to be because we have a little bit less colored sources in this deck versus the um eggs deck so just testing that out hopefully we don't run into wildfire so this mana base is a little bit greedy today and then we have one polluted mire which is cycle land to uh tutor up with our expedition map over here in the sideboard, Jace's Erasure can still be used now with Conjurer's Bobble to mill out our opponent. Uh, hopefully that works. We have four Quark Clan Shaman. Previously I was playing the Chainer's Edicts, but I found that uh, all of the Terror decks were pretty prepared against Chainer's Edicts, so I'm going to be playing Quark Clan Shaman trying to wipe the board against things. It actually was very good against uh, my one pairing with Walls. I'm playing two scatter shots as a sweeper as well for Fey and stuff. And also is very good against familiars and Tron decks. Three Fangren Marauders uh, as our top end life gain. 
two more weather the storms as our storms as our early life gain two nile spell bombs for our anti-graveyard and then one shattering pulse this is destroy target artifact with buyback three i think this is going to be good with refractor in the meta uh and also to to try to fight through relics on the board because it doesn't go to the graveyard so we can just keep eating all the relics so we might bring that in against a relic deck it's also an instant that we could tutor with mystical teachings that is the deck if you're interested in supporting this content please check out the patreon uh, where you can get discord access and sideboard guides we also would like to encourage you to like and subscribe leave a comment let me know how, what you thought of the deck maybe the, what changes i could make if i made some play mistakes so i appreciate that it's always good to talk to everybody and i will see you in the matches Okay, round one versus Parallax, and we are going to have to mulligan. So we have mine. We can probably put a Blood Fountain back. Uh, yeah. Parallax is generally on familiars. So we're going to play the Expedition Map and Pass. Turn 2, grab our power play, and turn 3, Golem Foundry. And then look for a tower as fast as possible, basically. Wait, or we need another thing that we can hit with this Reckoner's Bargain. Okay. There's a Foundry. going to evoke a mold drifter immediately I'm trying to draw cards Ooh, okay star just draw into natural tron is always nice star crack for black draw a card uh let's play the retriever Put this over here. And then I'm going to actually recognize Bargain the Retriever to get back the star. <laughs> uh, play out the star. Black. And then Deadly Dispute, the other star. We're just drawing so many cards so fast. Glamo. Uh, okay. And then I think I'll just play out this map. That probably doesn't matter. Pass. Okay, and I think that was too much, too fast. So we want the scatter shots, we want the spell bombs, potentially the Quark Clan shamans. We don't care about the crop rotation, I don't think. Munitions. Maybe scatter shots not as good as Quark here. We want to wipe their board. Don't need the weather the storm at all. Put the refractor back in. Let's see. We could maybe cut one blood fountain. <clears throat> so the plan is to just try to wipe their board and then uh, exile all their stuff. I feel like the Clark Clan Shaman is better at wiping the board than Scattershot is in this deck. Maybe not. I guess if we want to go fast, we could get rid of these, put the crops back in, put the scatter shots in. That'll probably be better. They generate a lot of storm. Okay, we're on the draw now. We have to watch out for dust to dust, which is unfortunate, but we do have our two lands into energy refractor, so I'm going to keep that. Let's see if they have a turn two play. They don't. So we can safely land our energy refractor here. If we draw into a third land, we can play it. Oh, wow, we just have natural. We don't have natural Tron. Okay. <clears throat> to get rid of our refractor forever, we're going to tower, map, 
grab our power plant. I thought we had natural drawn for a second there. Familiar. Plays of modern age. Okay, prismatic strands is good for them. Uh, power plant. Play foundry. Play chromatic star. You can play around dust at us by doing hitting a teachings right now. It's probably fine. Blue. Cast mystical teachings. Grab deadly dispute. Go ahead and jam a wellspring. They could still dust us here. <clears throat> they could dust us here, but then we have wellspring plus dispute and potentially uh, other stuff from there. Looks like they're gonna dust. Place familiar, okay. And then dust dust. Uh okay. Do, 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 do. Grotto. Play Wellspring. We're gonna d dispute it. If we draw into our second scatter shot, that'd be good. Oh, okay. Um, play spell bomb. Play wellspring. Spell bomb you. Let's see if they respond. Unfortunately, they played right into my hand. That was pretty lucky for us. <clears throat> we got rid of all of their these two familiars in play, and we got rid of the dust to dust. Okay. Now they're down to three cards. Wow. They are going to ephemerate the modern age to draw. They're going to loot here. So they need to get another creature in play so that their uh, ephemerate is going to be good. They're going to cast Archaeomancer to get back ephemerate. Pretty good. Mirror Retriever. Um... Let's see. If I draw another Retriever, if I draw another, yeah, if I draw another Retriever, I have infinite mana, or infinite storm, but that doesn't do very much. So let's just try drawing some cards. Deadly Dispute. Let's deadly dispute the retriever, get back the spell bomb, I guess. I feel like I still want the wellspring. Still drawing a ton of cards. Okay, so there's my second retriever. Play this wellspring out. A bobble. So I can play the Grotto. Just play the Grotto. Let's cry. Uh, I'll top that, I guess. And then play out this Bobble. Hmm. Is there anything I want to Bobble yet? Maybe just a Dispute. Bobble. Get back Dispute. Bargain this wellspring. Okay, so we're going to discard um, 
this, this. We have to discard four cards. I guess this other one. So map's not very good here. Yeah, I get rid of the maps. Cause I'm trying, I'm trying to keep my uh, deck, but I should have probably gotten rid of the crop rotation. Okay, they get their um, ephemerate back. We still have one scatter shot in the deck. We're looking for golem foundry and then scatter shot. Cast another arcane answer, gets back ephemerate. Okay. Two mana. What's Grotto? I'm still looking for a Golem Foundry. Hello, top. So we're going to cycle. Play Golem Foundry. Play Altar. Yes. Then we're going to play Mirror Retriever. And we got there. All right. See you in the next match. Round two versus top grinder, current trophy leader, and I believe a player of Cogate. But we have turn three Tron. Crop rotation not very good, but uh, we have the right picture order and everything, so I'm going to keep it. Lead on mine into map. And your turn. And the opponent is going to play. Oh, they're on affinity. Well, that's not as fun. Land, grab a tower. At least it's affinity and not just guy ephemerate. Tower, foundry, retriever. We can beat affinity. Map. F6. With the map, we're going to want to get the grotto so that we can start using our colored spells. They cast a thought cast. Let's see if they blow up my mirror retriever. Looks like no. And they play a wellspring, and they accidentally went to eight cards in hand, so now they have to discard. Discard Chainer's Edict. We're going to map, grab a grotto, play the grotto. Sure. Get that on top. Attack. Bargain this. Get back a map. And we'll go ahead and play all three. Hmm. We can Chromatic Star. And then crop a tower. Green. Crop. Tower. Grab tower. Grab weather the storm. Play map. Okay, there goes our picture order, but that's cool. Map for the mire. Get back the bargain. We have another map. Okay. Now we can play map for grotto. We can also crop a rotation this mine for a tower. Uh, I think I'm going to not pop one of these out. <sighs> Looks like they could have a metallic rebuke here. So, map, grab this, grab a grotto, play the grotto. Deadly Dispute's great, put on top, play a Wellspring. In this matchup we do need Deadly Disputes to live because they have a ton of power. 
And they could be bringing in their Gitek. They could be playing the Gixian thing. It continues to grow and grow and grow. And right now they're going to sit on it. Plays out a Shaman. Okay. Oops. I forgot to make my creature. That was big oops. A deadly dispute. Okay, we'll draw a card. We found a ball. Play mine. Tap. Green. Crop the mine. Crow tower. Play foundry. And then I'm gonna attempt to deadly dispute. Another foundry. Okay, energy refractor is nice. Play this refractor. Yes. Play a bobble. Then I'm gonna bobble back the other bobble right now. Teachings. I can just play another refractor and then jam a weather the storm. Bazoop. We're at 39. Deal with it. <laughs> okay, they deadly dispute. I was trying not to give them value, just sacrificing all their wellsprings. Now, on their attack step, I'm going to pop out two golems. They wellspring. We have one more weather storm that we can teachings for. Block, block. Are you going to sacrifice and then uh, wipe? They're just gonna let that happen. Okay. Plays blood fountain so they can get it back. Sure. Frogmite. Let's make some power so we can start attacking them. Land. Attack with everything. Play out another foundry. Play out mirror retriever. Always yes here again. And then we're going to just go ahead and explode our Mirror Retriever. And get back another Mirror Retriever. And then we have we start looping. Okay. And now we have the Ashnot's Altar, but I guess we have enough mana. Altar time for me. Uh, uh, uh. Okay. Play Mirror Retriever. Alright. Sweet. Go to post board. Do I... I guess Shattering Pulse could be pretty good here. Um, we want the Fanger Marauders. We don't need the munitions. Um, we can maybe... Tr well, they're going to be bringing in their Nile Spell Bombs, but I guess Shattering Pulse deals with that. So then we need to make some more cuts. Maybe trim on the... I don't really want to trim on this anymore now that I, I don't have any way to make infinite mana otherwise. Maybe the crop rotation is not really necessary. And then we can get rid of one blood fountain. Let's see if that'll work. We're trimming on our infinite combo, but 
we are trying to set up better against their uh, sucking everything deck. All right, we cannot keep this one. Mine power plant. We have refractor altar. I'm gonna keep. So what do we want to put back? It seems like it's just the bobble, unfortunately. I would have liked to have a turn one cantrip, but I I want all these other ones. We're gonna lead on the refractor, I think. Land go. Maybe the bobble is better than the wellspring in this position. Okay, they're slamming all their stuff from their hand. We have natural Tron because we got lucky. <laughs> Let's see if we can draw into disputes as well. Looks like no at the m moment. They're holding up a metallic rebuke. But we have Tron. They are going to play out their infiltrator. No. It just thought cast plays a now spell bomb. Let's see if we can draw our shattering pulse. Oh, we have, we found it. Okay. Do 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 do. Um. Cast wellspring. Teachings. Get the pulse. Let's see if they have a Hydroblast. Makeshift Munitions. Alright, we're going to Teachings again. Black. Grab a Deadly Dispute. Just play out a Bobble. Six. And they're going to shoot us one. Not super concerned because we have Weather the Storm. Get rid of the spell bomb and then we can alter retriever and go off. Mirror Enforcer. Okay, so let's see if this works the way that I want it to. <laughs> Grotto. Oh, wait, they can just... Uh, put on the bottom. So let's start with... Red. Blow that up. So since they can just sacrifice it, then this doesn't really work, does it? It doesn't. They smack, They cast a Deadly Dispute. They pay. So now we can Deadly Dispute our own Wellspring. And then we get to just cast Weather the Storm. So they were able to stop our Shattering Pulse. So it looks like Shattering Pulse is not very good versus Affinity. And apparently not very good versus uh, Relic either. It looks like the better card to play would be a uh, Ancient Grudge. Casting some spells. We have the loop now. A bobble. Let's bobble back this pulse. And then bobble back the bobble. Land. Play star. I'll have Two golems here, black, blood fountain, 
Okay, so now we have the uh, the full-on loop where we just draw our deck, and uh, that should be the game, but we'll see. We'll just have to untap and hope they don't kill us somehow. Kills a mirror retriever. We're going to get back the uh, bobble. So I believe they have to um, sacrifice everything during the attack phase if I put out the golem foundry because of how priority works. So I'm going to attempt to uh, put these golems into play now. See what happens. They deadly dispute their quirk. Okay. They play another quirk. And if Frogmite. Alright, that's good. Having the second golem foundry means we can actually generate mana a lot easier. So now we play Alter. Always yes. And then let's see if we can uh, show off this combo here. Make some mana. All right. They might just scoop, but we'll see. We're going to sack the Retriever, get back Retriever, play the Retriever, and then do that over and over. I'm going to play Retriever. All right, let me just uh, rearrange things a little bit here. Okay, we're making some golems. So now for every three loops, we get one golem and uh, two mana. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and pop out a golem, pop out a golem, pop out a golem. And I'm going to start sacrificing them for mana. Sacrifice this. Get back. I don't know. Let's get back everything. Get back this wellspring. Play the wellspring. We're just drawing cards now. Now I'm going to play out the map and crack it so I can actually shuffle the deck. Play out this bobble. Bobble back the dispute. Blood fountain the retrievers. And then black over here. So we're see we get back the retrievers. Sacrifice one of these. Play Retriever. Uh, sacrifice Retriever. Get back the Blood Fountain. Play Retriever. Alright, how much mana do we have now? <sighs> okay, so just go ahead and get more mana. Play Wellspring. Just doing stuff. Okay. Uh, sacrifice this. Play Mirror Retriever. Okay, make some more mana. We just got to get to the point where we get our... Uh... Wow, sorry. We have to get to the point where we get our uh, Finger Marauder. Let's play Refractor to draw a card. Always yield. That's a bargain. So I'm going to sacrifice this. I sacrifice this. Get back Mirror Retriever. I'm going to make a black over here. Reckoner's Bargain. Now I'm back to having the uh, easy loop with the mana. Play Mirror Retriever. 
And then we're going to get back Retriever again, over and over. And then sacrifice some more cards. Do do do. Play, go black here. Deadly Dispute. Did I take out the munitions? I did, I believe. All right, play Expedition Map. Sacrifice Retriever. Get back Retriever. Now we can um, start using our loot. All right, what do I want to do here? Let's Sacrifice Retriever for Retriever again. I just have infinite options, basically. Let's play a Wellspring. Draw a bobble. All right, let's sacrifice a guy. All right, get some mana over here. Play another one. Looking for a Fangren Marauder, basically. They might scoop to Fangren Marauder. We're just looping, 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 looping. I mean, if you're doing this in paper, you're just like, okay, I'm just going to draw my deck. I'm going to draw, 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 and then you, you lose. Oh, we have another uh, land drop. That's nice. Okay, sacrifice. Go ahead and sacrifice this. Map. Grab tower. Play the tower. Okay. Uh, we can... Let's try looting. Discard this. Play bobble. So basically you can just get everything back because of the way the bobbles work and the mirror triggers can just get back the bobbles. Alright, play out these. Sacrifice. Sacrifice again. Go black. Bargain. Draw more cards. There's the Marauder. Okay. Okay. Let's generate some mana. And now I think I want to just make a bajillion tokens. Alright. Alter this. Alter this. Uh, green. Marauder. Okay. There we go. <laughs> Feels good. See you in the next one. Okay. We are here in round three on the draw versus JS Jacivics. And we have turn three Tron. We have a blocker with Retriever. We have Golem Foundry. Looks like they're playing Mono Blue Delver. Golem Foundry is really good versus Mono Blue Delver, so let's see if we can make that stick. We don't have a uh, scattershot to teachings for. Hmm. They're going to get in. They're going to ninja. Okay. This is not very good for me, but, you know, we're going to go ahead and map for power plant. They get in again. Kablam. Plays a fairy seer. You got it, boy. So we know they had Miscreant in hand. So they still have that. Power plant. We're just going to go ahead and play out the Golem Foundry. See if that will resolve. Likely that will get countered. I guess it does not. Okay, so we'll play out a Wellspring. See if that eats counter. Looks like they are just really, really wanting to use their spell starter sprite. So we'll play the Mirror Retriever. And we can go ahead and block the ninja and get back to Wellspring. So post board, we have scatter shots over here, which are really good in this matchup. Get back the Wellspring. They play a Miscreant. Another miscreant. Okay. 
we're gonna go ahead and I guess we play out the grotto first. Uh, I'm gonna bottom the land, play the refractor, play wellspring, and I'm going to play out. Oh, actually, we have more we can do. We can just go ahead and play star. Crack the star for black. Play this blood fountain. And that gets me another up to two golems. We're going to get back our mirror retriever. Play a wellspring. No spell pierce from the opponent. Now we really need two teachings for a weather the storm to stay alive. They're going to be hitting us for four. I guess it's not that much damage. They're just going to slam in for four. All right, we will put some golems into play. Cast another, well, I wonder if golem founder's not good here. Guess we cast it anyway. Okay, resolves. Uh, cast Blood Fountain. Resolves. Cycle, well, play Grotto. Tower. Okay, I think I want the tower. I'm gonna cycle here. What I want to do actually. Uh yeah, we'll cycle this. Can't really do anything else. I'm going to attack with one golem. Oh no. Now they can double block my golem. Yep, he's dead. So we want to go teachings for weather, teachings again for deadly dispute, and then cast weather. We're going to get hit for five. Okay, just civics. What you got? You can also fountain the retriever. Oh, just four. I forgot that the brine barrow doesn't fly. Okay, no, no blocks for me. Found the weather naturally. Interesting. Um. Cast teachings. Let's see if that resolves. They could just spell sitter spread it at this point. Which they do. That stinks. Um so this guess we just gain nine. That doesn't feel very good. Weather the storm. I'm going to attack. They have so many fairies. We still have a teachings for weather that we can play. Okay. Found a deadly dispute. I 
don't know what they're gonna do. They have six attacks. We need the teachings to resolve. Are they gonna tap? No. Okay. So if we find a cast of one mind, all right. Plays a land. Tax are six. Go to three. We're going to cast our deadly dispute. Looking to draw into combo pieces or weather the storm again. They have a spell sprite. Alright, um, we draw a bargain anyway. We are going to cast teachings. Get the weather the storm. <laughs> oh man, that's a good draw. Wow. Uh, okay. So let's try leading on the bargain here. Go to five. Cast this refractor. Play a mine. Okay. I guess we, we probably want to get this munitions into play. And then six mana. Try doing one loot. They're just gonna scoop to the munitions, okay. Uh we still want we wanted to be able to cast the weather storm after all that, but yeah, blast them. Okay, so we want this shot scatter shots. And that's gonna be about it. Maybe maybe the Fangin Marauders. Fangin Marauders um, are really good against them because they can't actually deal with it. Golem Foundry is really important. I don't know. I think we just uh, take out a crop here, and then bring this to scatter shots, and then hope that's good enough. There's not a lot of space. I think Golem Foundry is really important. Uh, we have mine. Don't have much going on. We can... I think I'm going to keep it anyway, because we can grotto looking for a power plant or something to cast. Scattershot. Although being on the draw is pretty bad. Okay, grotto. So we have crop rotation now. Bobble's good. To play nothing. Okay, we'll, we'll also play nothing. Play a Miscreant. Alright. Tower. Pass. They get in. Power plant. Okay, let's see. I think I'm going to pass again. I really want to scatter them out. Four cards in hand for the opponent. That's nothing. Puts me to 14. Play mine. So I'm going to lead on tower because... I mean, on golem foundry. Just makes sense no matter what. They cast a spell setter sprite. And we will let that resolve. And then go ahead and play out our scatter shot. See if that wrecks them. This one and this one. Did we get there? <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's go. See you in the next one. Round four versus Baladin. They used to play Tron. A lot of Tron. This doesn't have colored sources. We have the Golem Foundry and the munitions, but I think I'm going to mulligan. Uh, it's still sketchy, but I'm going to keep this one and put back a mine. There's a lot that needs to go right for this for this to work. And they are on Cogate, so that's step one. Land go. Now we have a tower. Then we'll play Golem Foundry turn three, I guess. 
They're just gonna hold up counter spells. Pass. Play a Golem Foundry. Assuming it'll be countered. It resolves. That's weird. That's not what I expected at all. So I guess next turn we play out the altar. Preordain. We probably need to try to draw a card with the bobble though. Although, we don't want to play into Journey to Nowhere. 3 mana, Oblivion Ring, okay. They probably only have one ring in their deck. Let's go Star, Crack for Black. Okay, play Bobble. Bobble back nothing. Okay, play Map. Seems pretty good. Now we can start doing our value plays of uh, Sacrifice Fountain for Retriever, play Retriever, and then loot. <laughs> it's like, a, how much does this cost? One, five, six, seven. It's so much mana just to do this looting. Found the power plant anyway. Okay. Let's play out this altar. I feel like that's going to eat a counterspell, but it may not. Play, let's crack this map. And grab a tower, since now we have the energy refractor. Play mirror retriever. Let's see if they counter the mirror retriever. And it's a yes on that. Okay. We can just get the re Retriever back with our Blood Fountains, as I was saying. No big deal. F6. Wait, do we have a land? No. We missed a land drop, so... Your turn. Oh, they're going to get rid of the Retriever. That's a bummer. Okay. Grotto with a scry. Probably gonna have to loot a little here. Makeshift munitions. It's... Um, don't think I want that here. Let's go ahead and play out our blood fountain. Then I'm going to uh, get a token. I'm gonna loot. Loot away the tower. Even though I wanted that mana, I needed to land. Wellspring. Okay, cast a Wellspring again. I don't think that it's necessary for me to cast the Weather of the Storm on this turn, so I'm just going to play Blood Fountain and loot again. If so many exile effects. Got rid of my mirror retriever and my golem foundry. I was not ready for all that. I thought I had it in the bag. Okay, now we're looking for a deadly dispute or another mirror retriever. They get in for one. Uh, mirror retriever is good. Hello, play retriever. You can counterspell it, and I'll just get it back. I'll play it again. Okay, Sacrifice Retriever. Get back Bobble. Play Bobble. I should not have gotten the Bobble back. That was a mistake. Alright, let's go Black. Blood Fountain, the Retriever. Play the Retriever. 
And then we can retrieve the bullet fountain. Although, I don't know if I want to... Oh yeah, I can retrieve the blood fountain this turn. Yeah, that makes sense to me now. I was thinking like, oh no, what happens if they have another uh, Dawnbringer Cleric? And I was like, oh no, I can just get rid of the Mirror Tree at the Conjurer's Bobble. Makes sense. Now we get our blood token. We're just, we have a bunch of loots that we can do. And we cast Weather the Storm and pass. All good. Two mana. Dawnbringer Cleric. Okay. Yeah. And then I just bobble it. Boink. Draw another Mirror Retriever. I want to be actually getting the Chromatic Stars, I think. Alright. I'm going to loot. Get rid of the Altar. Chromatic Star. Sacrifice it for black. Doesn't really matter. Oh no, actually we do want the black because of the Blood Fountain. Tower's nice. Play me Retriever. Sacrifice the Retriever for the Chromatic Star. And then I'm going to play it for black again. Okay, draw a card. And another one. Found a deadly dispute finally. Dispute the wellspring. They're gonna counterspell the dispute and dispel the dispute, okay? Uh, let's cycle. Found a teachings. So, Blood Fountain, the Mirror Retriever. And then I'll just cast Retriever. Okay. We're still doing stuff. We're in the game. Nothing much has happened. We we have a lot of value. We have a lot of mana. We have two power of attackers. I'm just going to take it. Still have the weather of the storm. Not very concerned. Interesting that they're playing Dispel over something like Spell Pierce. They have no um, Basilisk in play at all. My turn. Okay, let's... Teachings first. Grab a Deadly Dispute. Okay, I'm going to play Grotto. See what we see. Bottom that. I'm going to go ahead and attack. Kablamo. Alright. Let's filter for black, and then dispute over here. Draw some cards off this wellspring. Draw a golem foundry, and another golem foundry and a mirror tree. So, is that GG? Foundry. All right. Going to post board. So, crop rotation is not really required anymore here. Shattering Pulse, maybe, probably not. Scattershot could be coming in. The Fang and Marauders are decent. I think that Weather the Storm is generally better. That seems fine. We do have to watch out for them having uh, revokes and dusts and all that stuff. They have a lot of exile effects. Okay, I'm going to keep this hand for sure. We have a Swamp for potentially the Deadly Disputes. We have Munitions for all their 1-1s, one but they do have Dawnbringer Clerics and stuff. 
we have wellsprings and whatnots. We can play munitions, but after we play wellspring, and then we can just shoot them with the wellspring. It's nice to get value out of the wellspring. All right, land star. We could crack the star for red right now to play, play out the munitions. They're just going to revoke? No, okay. I'd be surprised. Okay, so in trying to play around a um, Dust to Dust, we can consider not... They're going to discard their Dawnbringer Cleric. Okay, punish. Red. Maybe they have two in hand. Munitions. They could have their uh, Oblivion Ring or whatever. They discard a land here. Preordained. Next turn we have Tron, so we'll probably just play out the map and grab Tron. Grabs a relic, okay. Sure. It looks not super good. Map. Okay, go ahead and grab power plant. Save some time. Oh, we gotta grab the mine. That was a close one. Okay. They have a vector glider, which they will probably try to pump up. Sure. Goodbye to our map. Mine. Wellspring. Refractor. Guess I'm just going to cast everything. Fountain. Wellspring. <laughs> I'm just going to cast everything out from my hand. Casting, casting, casting. Got the Wellspring in play, put the Bobble in play. Probably should have waited on playing the Golem Foundry. Uh, play, playing the Bobble before I had the Golem Foundry in play. You know what I just realized is that I have completely played into Dust to Dust here, which was a mistake. Oops. But they don't have it. They're going to gate up their 2-3. The tower. The Golem Foundry. See if they have a counterspell. Okay. So what I'm going to do is bobble this. And then they're going to respond. And then I'm going to loot. Draw a card. There's a mirror retriever. Get rid of this. Bobble. Dispute. Okay. So we can deadly dispute. Wellspring. Find a mine. Oh man, we were so close. So close. I wonder if I want to just scatter shot here. Don't think it matters. Uh, I think I'm just going to deadly dispute again. Because that's going to give me more cards. To do, to do, to do. Play out a chromatic star. Alright, we have the combo. And we can brute force through the relic. with the Blood Fountain. We just want to play out the... Okay. They have a Dawnbringer Cleric to blow up what? The munitions? Okay.
Hmm. I wonder if we have a... We don't have a second, uh... Or did we take out a Blood Fountain? So if we have a... We have both Blood Fountains in, in our deck. Okay. So we can make infinite mana and we can draw a couple of cards. Although we're going to lose the one Blood Fountain, I think. Probably want to play the Mirror Retriever, Sacrifice Retriever for Wellspring, so that we can use that to draw a bunch of cards. Or play out the Altar first. Probably play out the Altar first, in case they have a counter spell. No, we have to play the Mirror Retriever. Right, that's the first thing we do. See if they have a counter spell. Okay, Retriever. And then at the end of the turn, we can just wipe them anyway. Play Altar. Do you have it? Counter. Okay. So now... Bargain. This. They sacrifice. We Blood Fountain. Get back the altar. Uh, okay, I see what happened here. I messed up, didn't I? Get, get rid of uh, the dis dispute. I did mess up. Whoopsies. this. So I lost an altar here. That's disappointing. Alright. Do, do, do. Still get to draw some two cards. We have a weather the storm. I guess I'll just weather here. Green. Cast weather. I think we're still probably favored to win. So we can play out our retrievers and bargain them. Although losing that altar was kind of a pain. So I did not think that went through. I thought I could get back both of them. That's okay. That is one big 2 3. It's actually a 6 7. Alright. Go like this. Block. Gonna play Mirror Retriever. Crack for black here. Bargain the Retriever. Get back the star. Okay. Uh, land. Attack you. Play star. Play Retriever. Gonna dispute the retriever. And then grab the other one. Draw some cards. Play out a retriever. Play out a refractor, I guess. Draw a card. Play out a star. Let's bargain the retriever. Black. Get back the retriever. And then what where are we now in our lives? Can't play that. Do, do, do. We can play the blood fountain with this token. And we'll pass. I'm not overly concerned about the gated up two three. If they uh oh. If they use their entire turn, I will go ahead and uh just kill it next turn on my turn. They are going to play out a dust dust. Yeah, it's fine. We have a lot more where that came from. But they're just going to die. Uh, okay. Okay, 
Step one, you take nine. All right. Step two, play a wellspring. I suppose we should have uh, played the map. Fine. I don't think we need to. Deadly dispute. Wellspring. Let's see if we can draw it into our other combo pieces. We have a couple left. Golem Foundry. Play the Foundry. Oops, cancel. Play Refractor. Okay, they're just going to scoop that. Cool. See you in match five. All right, we're here versus Adepto Terra. He's on the play. Uh, man, it, this is real close. I think I'm going to mulligan to be safe. We don't have double cantrip. Even if we draw land off, if we don't draw land and we crack the star, then we have no colors. So I'm going to mulligan. All right, I'm going to keep here. Get rid of, I guess, a single retriever. Looking to draw into a deadly dispute. They have a mine, so they're probably just going to be playing, uh, hmm, expedition map. Interesting. Did not expect map. They could be playing Control Tron. Gonna be a tough matchup for us. Tron Mirror, baby. All right. Uh, yes, we just. I think I'm gonna run out the Wellspring. Try to draw into one of the other missing Tron pieces so I can play the map and get the third. We miss. They have their own map. They get their they get Crystal Grotto. Okay. Don't know what that means. Could be anything still. They must have ta Tron then. They're going to crop the Grotto. They're going to play Impulse in response to the Scry Trigger. Okay, so it is to control Tron. I think we can beat them. The problem is going to be trying to beat a weather the storm. But they only have so many things. Bogtron is going to be uh, able to d defeat our uh, many, many... Oh, man. Try to draw land. Whiff again. Okay, we have double crop. What are they going to cast? Another impulse? I'm surprised that they did that. They missed on lands. There's a tower. Place refractor, I imagine. Yep. Okay, we found Deadly Dispute, which means we can crop. Deadly Dispute this Wellspring. Wait, let me think this through. No, yeah. I still have to do this. Dispute the Wellspring. Find a power plant. Play the plant. Tap. Green. Crop this. I have a tower. Play out the foundry. Play out mirror retriever. And then we're going to play a map. So we have to be able to combo underneath all their permission, which is going to be tough. And they could be playing something like a, uh, what's its face? Didn't robe a horror, which would be really problematic. Let's play a grotto. That's an okay draw, but not great. I'm gonna bottom it. And swing. That's gonna be a tough match. Ten mana? What? They're just gonna teachings. And then teachings again.
Let me get that grotto value, bottom. So that just basically puts us out of range of the uh, Rolling Thunder, but I ex expect we're going to lose. Mnemonic Wall gets back Mystical Teachings. Okay. I can just Teachings for Fog or whatever. Wow. We are dead, though. Okay, let's see what they get. They're going to get Counterspell? Wow, greedy. All right, pass. Play the tower. If you're going to tap out for Counterspell, I'm going to hold up my teachings for uh, the Prime moment. Cast their own teachings. Counterspell. Alright, uh, what are you going to get? I think I'm going to cast my own teachings here. What are they going to get, though? Could be anything. Even a boat. All right, we'd lose. They just have too much, too many permissions. So we need the erasure, get rid of weathers. And what else can we do? The shattering pulse is going to be great. That's exactly what we need. Uh, spell bomb. Probably good. Shattering Pulse to get rid of all of their artifacts is, is, feels really good. Um, munitions maybe is not good enough. Although it is a second, a different wind condition. Hmm. We need these spell bombs. Maybe just cut this and trim one foundry. I don't like going down on uh, the combo, but I'm going to do that. This is specifically to kill all their artifacts. If we can get them off of colored sources, that'd be great. Okay. So we want to open up Tron and a lot of drop. We have the pulse. I can't keep this. Oh my goodness. I think I'm to mulligan again. Maybe not. They mulled a six. This just feels so sketchy. Okay, keep. Put back the blood fountain. Put back the... Hmm. Spell bomb. Put back the star fountain. Grotto, looking for a tower or dispute. Bottom that. Okay. So we lost our first our first match or game anyway. <sighs> okay, so we have Tron now. Draw some cards. Found a mirror retriever. We need deadly disputes. They're going to do nothing, I imagine. Found the Deadly Dispute. Hey yo. Mirror Retriever. So, I don't know if uh, it matters. Let's see. I'm trying to think about how we can Deadly Dispute and draw some cards. Looks like they're going to have their own refractor immediately. Plays a map. OK. 
Okay, tower. Play Wellspring. We're looking to draw into that Shattering Pulse. We're going to attack for one. Big power. Black. And we'll dispute here. Totally fine with uh, getting rid of a counterspell from the graveyard. Okay, bobble. And then we'll bobble back the deadly dispute. Found a munitions. They did not have a counter before. I'm going to play out the munitions. Grab my wellspring. They could bajukabog us. Weather the storm? Crop rotation, okay. They've got the Bogadoo. Completely expected that one. And then they just uh, go ahead and get Tron back. Come on, Shattering Pulse. Blow up your your uh, artifacts and keep you off of colored sources. They literally have no colored sources other than the Refractor. They cycle a remote aisle. They just don't think I'm going to be playing Ancient Grudge or anything. I'm going to play out this Mirror Retriever. Spell bomb you. And then try to draw two cards and get back the spell bomb. They have a flicker. Wow. Unreal. Or are they going to counter it? Nope, they're going to flicker. This is why people like... <laughs> Darn, we're getting wrecked by Tron here. We lost two already. Okay, play this Golden Foundry out. F6. So now all they have to have is a wall, and then they just destroy us. Pretty brutal. I didn't feel like I played uh, too aggressively there. Just got wrecked. And now they have an Ancient Grudge. I'm going to blow up my Refractor as well. Cast an Impulse. It's so, so insane. We just need to get past this stupid Refractor from their side. Ugh. Um, land. Green. Crop. Good Grotto. Attempt to draw some cards. They're going to have a counter spell and we're just going to scoop. Oh, hello. Blow that up. Looking for a counter. They can't, they'd have to have Dispel at this point. Oh, okay. So I feel a little bit better. They have one island now. 
cast mole drifter. I guess we could die to the drifter beats. Foretells a behold the multiverse. Play tower. Pass. We found the pulse, but we <laughs> basically are not going to be able to win anyway. We need we need a lot to go right. They're jamming. Do do do. Probably gonna lose, but we're going for it. Four mana. Cast behold a multiverse. What are they gonna do? Probably scribe. Top top. One top, one bottom. We are looking for our Nile spell bombs, basically. It got another blue source. Plays another mole drifter. A Icker Wellspring would be okay here. Energy Refractor. Try to kill it. They have the counter spell. All right. Uh, play retriever. Shoot you. Get back refractor. So I can draw a card. Play refractor. Draw a card. Play star. Crack for black. Okay, Wellspring, chaining a little bit. Shoot you one. Found a map. Can play map and then sacrifice it for the polluted mire. Play mine. Crack for black. Or, I mean, play star. Ugh. Just could not get there. They have their wall. They have a drifter. It's going to yield. We take six. <sighs> We're setting an upkeep stop so that we can f get rid of these lands. Another mole drifter. We can kill all their mole drifters. Uh, that would be awesome. Maybe we could do that. Like kill all their mole drifters and then find the Nile spell bomb and then just kill exile their yard and then they just literally can't kill us maybe that can happen what's he gonna discard seems unlikely Play this out. They're going to counter my Wellspring? Bro, no! Alright. I will bow to your power, Mr. Fo Fogtron, uh, to the death. It's so unfair that they get to play Counterspell. Refractor is so busted. Okay. Well, we had a pretty awesome league, but we're going to flounder in the end here against Controltron. Let's go to the deck.
So if you want to beat Controltron, you probably want to be playing some sort of uh, deadly dispute, some ancient grudges. Let's see. So we probably want to update. This should be ancient grudge here. And then uh, maybe another Nile spell bomb. Maybe Scattershot is not worth it, but I think that otherwise, like, everything went pretty well. So thanks for checking it out. We'll see you in the next video.